What people forget is that Tom Cruise was something special. The way he slid across that hardwood floor, straight into our hearts. He was a hot shot. As a bartender, as a fighter pilot, in various other military positions, he was a natural. He made it look easy, but he also worked very fucking hard. This kid came from nothing, emerged out of nowhere, a Yankee, as Robert Duvall calls him in the 1990 NASCAR drama Days of Thunder, and he wasn't about to give it all up. There was that boyish grin that said, can you believe how good I am at this? But behind that smile seemed to lurk an ego, a temper, and an inferiority complex. Nicole Kidman must have sensed this. There is a scene in Days of Thunder, at the beginning of their relationship, where Cruz and Kidman first sleep together. Cruz is looking at her and says he knows she's asking herself, how could I, a brilliant brain doctor, be in bed with a guy who drives a car for a living? We can see that he's right, but it's also obvious why she's there. Do something that will make me respect you, she says, and gets on top of him. Afterwards he explains how drafting works, using Sweden low packets to represent cars and her upper thigh as the racetrack. Sure, he's troubled, but he's also charming and exciting. Tom Cruise must have been hard to resist. A few months ago, I found myself interviewing for a job with Netflix's original content department and the woman on the phone asked me which things on Netflix I had been enjoying lately. I realized at this point that I was probably supposed to mention a few of Netflix's series, perhaps Orange is the New Black or House of Cards, but I hadn't actually watched any of Netflix's original programming. I was living by the, questionable, notion that I didn't want any job that would require me to pretend to be somebody I'm not. So I told her the truth, I've been watching a lot of old Tom Cruise movies lately. I received a very polite rejection email a few days later. Consequently, I've had a lot of time to think about Tom Cruise. I'm sure I could look online and learn lots of things about his life.